Starting up eight points in that run by the Pacers. Again, it's Shea going right into Jackson. Buddy Hill and Tyrese Halliburton. They are both in the starting lineup tonight. Oh, nice pass. Trey, man, slipped it. See how spaced the floor is. Trey, man, well behind the three-point line, and he drills his third three in this first quarter. What a contest by Baisley. Got up there to block the drive of Stevenson. Now he's running the floor, taking it all the way to the rim, going coast to coast. Baisley, what a sequence. I believe a foul on OKC, and this is the... The 90-foot transition, one-man fast break. You know, so it makes him so dangerous. And that's what can be so tantalizing from Baisley. 6'9", can defend, can dribble the ball up the floor, and a nice pass on the bounce. SGA found the cut of water. What makes him so fun to watch, too. And then SGA drawing the attention. He's got a double team. It is. It looks, seems like it is a committed effort by the Pacers to get in transition at every opportunity. SGA attacks, but Tazian is still able to score with the left hand. And Michael, the Thunder without a handful of guys again here tonight. Guys who have been out extended time. No Dort, Ty Jerome, JRE, Mike Muscala, Kenrich Williams. Is that three is good by Pokashevsky from downtown. I just think they haven't had a whole lot of practice time, but they look like they have. I'm going to tell you, folks, that's coaching. Oh, Pokashevsky wide open underneath, just snuck behind the block, and then Maladone found him. A contested three. Krejci got a hand in the face of Heald, forced to miss. Maladone slips it right to Saar, who's got himself an emphatic slam. He's really just opening up the game for the Thunder right now. In Indiana, we're going to fly back to Oklahoma City until you watch that movie. <laughs> Maladone from the outside. In transition, finding Saar, and then taking the three. Need some change on your tires to get around. As Baisley leans in and gets the bounce. Now Baisley, runs right into Jackson, instead pulls up for the shot. Nice touch, Darius Baisley. And clears it out. It's fundamental basketball. Oh, Wiggins, what a rugged drive. Not a problem, went right at Jackson and scores off the window. And Shane will calmly wind down this clock. Gives it a look. Being hounded by Brogdon, a good defensive player. Now he spins into the shot, and he got the roll. So calm, so collected. Who usually is taking threes, has drove to the cup the last couple of times. Is Baisley able to work his way underneath for the, for the slam? Third quarter is picking up where it left off in the first half. A lot of up and down, busted plays that turns into points on the board. Basically sticking with. SGA looking to make a move. Alibert, good defender, not a problem. SGA once again. Back-to-back, -back solid offensive nights. Shea looking strong. And, you know, he's just showing you so many areas of the game he's improved on from a season ago. Man, and I think he lobbed it up there to Saar, who cut it at the high point and throws it down. Gilgis Alexander, and this, I think, was a pass all along, Michael. What do you say? I'm going with the pass. Well, I hope they give him an assist. As... This is beautiful. He's collapsed. Well, he had three. Two defender took the. Stevenson, and the pass was deflected and picked off by Baisley. Just too much length. Can't sneak that across the passing lane. As you see the crafty move, man, behind his back, then floats it up and in. What a move. Here's that move moments ago, folks. Okay, look, that's, that's just wrong, man. You, you know. Smith's provided nine points off the bench for Indiana. I hurt my knee on that move, by the way. Oh, and SGA. Just to put down a fresh coat, no problem. He just continues to make track. And good defense by the Thunder. And Shea once again slicing his way right to the cup. And a difficult drive and finish by Shea Gildas Alexander. We talk about trying to find ways tonight to get into that painted area. I'll tell you, this guy right here. He is wearing the paint out right now. Shea wants to spread things out. Double team comes. Passes over to Poku. Swings it down to Maladon. Waited for the defense to come. Passes over to Waters. Catch fire three. And he beats the buzzer and knocks it down. Forcing the defense to kind of scramble. It's too late at that point because that guy's got a quick trigger. 
Oh, by the way, that's Lindy Waters. Nice shot to end the quarter. Yes! He's at nine assists and nine points. Been very selective with his shot. Maladon veers in. What a touch by Maladon. That was a high arc or almost a teardrop. Uh, sometimes you have to play this game. An anchor on that back line. Look at how high that got. That, that might be a teardrop, Mike. But Maladon just continues to find those creases in the Indiana defense. Ball movement to Pokashevsky outside Waters. He iced a three and got the three. The 650 mark of the fourth quarter. A lot of time. Poku, hesitation move. Not a problem. Goes right at Jackson. To keep this just a four point deficit as we get closer to crunch time here. Not trying to shoot the quick three. We're using, using that mid range game. And the turnover, the pass goes through the hands of Brissett. Shea on the release will take it himself and throw it down. Over 30 and three out of the last four games. If you want to get back in it, Start forcing some turnover. Can take the lead. Man, once again, one foot and shot is good. Lance Stevenson, who's been known as a good defender his entire career. Man, looking comfortable this time. Floats it up with that little hook shot. Now Shea trying to dribble it well outside the three-point line. Two defenders, Shea toward him, and he still got to the rack and scores on the layup. Move ahead by two. Boy, some high-level offense, and Brissett got tied up and turns it over. Here is Wiggins on the release, and he goes up for the slam. With the defense forcing some turnovers this time, it's Shea tying it up, creates the break, and Wiggins with an exclamation point. Something will have to overcome that now. Still only two points have been scored in almost three minutes. Halliburton turns the corner, but Shea came over and swipes it away at the rim. Looks like Halliburton had a clear avenue. Now SGA charging, kicks, Baisley, who was set up for that three. Hop step inside, right hand, and he puts it up and in. And finally, it's Mann ripping it away. Scoops it to SGA, to the rim, counted on a foul! without a stoppage. And Shea needs some oxygen.